Hi guys, how is it going? And so today we're going to do an electrical problem. Electrical problem, electrical switch around. So today I'm going to remove the back wiring and what goes from the right hand side of the dash on the right hand model of the 1500 and runs all the way down the bottom of the seal back to the back of the car. Back to the back, back to the car. Of the car. So this will involve backlights, back reversing lights fuel sender and then yeah so I'm going to take it off the yellow 1500 and put it on the red 1500 I've bought a video of it so you guys know what I'm doing thank you very much, hope you enjoy Firstly what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove the trim, but it's still held on with shit. This back loom travels from here all the way across the seal. This is a modification the old owner put in years ago, which I've also got removed and it wasn't put in properly. It all ran around the car holder. Firstly, if I remove this blue dodgy wiring. Run to the back of the car. Now all I'm doing here not inspecting the wiring because it looks like it's been melted. It looks like it's been melted at this point which at the moment only looks like the protective covering has and the wire looks damaged. Which is a good sign because I can re-wrap that. That'd be fine so if I cut that. Now as you can see, this blue wire has been implemented into the loom. Okay, it comes with here. So I'm going to take that off. I don't want that. is now out. I was just checking out a wire down here which is a fuel sender wire. Here yeah, but on my other MG I've already got it in place so I'm not I'm gonna cut this and splice this wire to the other one. Now it's a matter of labelling it all up. Yeah all working. Labelling takes a while but it does help in the long run. And 
have to do some repairs to it when you're doing. And then you can go in the rug top. So here as you saw before is some melted wiring. So really all I'm gonna do is very careful with the snips. Remove that. That sounds right. All the wires are fine, they just get dirty. Then, fresh electrical wire. Fresh electrical tape, sorry. And there is one repaired. Protective cover. Now we can try and get this in the shop. Get bloody interesting. So what I'm hoping to do is send this end in instead of filling this end out. All this is literally just a simple splicing kit. Fuel center connected. Oh, 
now you wanna do this. Literally just What I've done here guys, I've replaced these with these, uh, these are off my yellow card, they're a bit manky, but I'll get new plastics, and the reason I've done that is because these were bent, and I found them put in upside down as well, so now, you can see there's the other one, now I can connect these up, there's another thing off the list, one of them, So I'm going to leave it there guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, thank you very much.